The highlight of the week, sponsored by Dave Frannick Auto. Looking for that first car for your son or daughter? Don't panic. See Dave Frannick. We go to a raucous Pope John High School and watch freshman Bryce Aiken with a nice look inside to Mustafa Zhang, who goes strong for two, and Pope John takes a 2-0 lead over Sparta. But watch the great bull movement here by Sparta as Kevin Folds finds Mitch Cohen, who goes hard to the hoop as he scores, and it's 4-2 Spartans. Pope John comes right back here. It's Bryce Aiken with the three-pointer, and Pope John goes up 5-4. Then it's Ryan Izzo off the Aiken inbound pass for two, and Pope John goes up 15-6 over Sparta. And Izzo caps a personal 7-0 run here with the three-pointer, and Pope John is rolling with a 12-point lead, 18-6. Sparta's trying to hang around and watch the nice bounce from Zach Frick to Jake Melville, who pops the jumper, and Sparta trails 20-11 in this recent edition of the Battle of Sparta. Then watch Bryce Aiken do it on defense with the seal to set up the thunderous dunk by Mustafa Zhang and Pope John takes a 24-14 lead after a wild first quarter of play here at Pope John. Second quarter we go and it's Jermaine Lawrence with the steal and the feed to Bryce Aiken who's able to score despite a flying Austin Unglob and the Lions take a 19 point lead 39-20. Sparta remains in the game here watch Jake Melville with the nice slide step and he buries a three to cut Pope John's lead to 39-26. But it's Ryan Izzo again for Pope John with a nifty baseline move, and the Lions push their lead to 43-28. Sparta ends the half on a good note, watch Jake Melville with the full away three-pointer from the wing, but Pope John holds a 45-34 lead at the half. Now watch Sparta on the run out, it's Zach Frick to the big guy Kevin Folds, and Sparta trails 51-42. But Pope John pushes his lead to 61-45 here. Watch Noah Brown square up and knock down the three-pointer, and the Lions lead by 16. And Pope John takes a 66-49 lead after three quarters here. Watch Steve Zagnorski get the runner to fall, and it's all Pope John in this one, folks. And in the fourth quarter, it's Aiken who finished with 27 points as he goes to the hoop as Pope John rolls to a 95-58 American Division win to approve to 11-0 in the division and get the season sweep over the Spartans. Uh, you know, we played hard. We came out with a lot of intensity. You know, the crowd was huge. You knew it was a very important game to the school. So, you know, we wanted to prove them right. So we came out here and got a W. Just the rivalry. It's crazy. You know what? The game just played up to the hype and everybody just played. I think it's the best we played all year and everybody just played great. It, was, it feels great to get the win again. It's a testament to the work that we've done throughout the year because we played in some real wars and it's you know February 7th we're where we need to be uh, not quite but we're close to where we need to be uh, peaking toward, as we're going towards the state ch uh, state championship state uh, state playoffs. Our goal from the beginning of the season was state championship and I think we play like that tonight this is the caliber we know we could play too and if we play like this the whole time I think we're going to accomplish that goal. This was a tremendous performance against a very good Sparta team and coach Jason Asson here at Pope John has not been shy about his expectations and they'll need to play like this the Lions from here on out if they want to win the kind of tournament again and make a deep run in non-public end. Without question. I mean, there's a lot of good teams. The brackets came out today, and we were going to play Don Bosco first round, and then we got to go to Seton Hall Prep again. They're good. Uh, they're top 10 in the state for a reason. So we have to get a lot better between now and March 2nd to be able to compete with them. But, but we're on the right path.